Hi, I'm Tasneem Noor and I am the Faith Connector. And today I have a really fun question for you. Have you ever had fun just exploring yourself? Exploring what it would be like to experience different versions of yourself. Not be someone else but just be you in a different way. Well, I'm so happy to share with you today that I had that type of an experience today and I'm feeling on top of the world. And there are two things that you need to do um, in order to experience being a different version of yourself. Step number one, you decide. You decide who it is that you wish to be or what it is that you wish to experience and then you have to take action on that, right? Um, and the second thing is ask for support because asking for support will not only help you be more like take that action faster, um, but it will also help you to just feel more safe and connected in that space. So it's easier, right? So what did I do? Well, for the first time, I went from being all closed off and timid and shy with animals to really opening up to that possibility of what would it be like if I was open to loving the animals, like expressing my love. I've never hated animals, but I've always been cautious with with expressing my love or giving them attention because I just feel timid I you know I'm like oh those teeth are sharp and those nails oh my goodness you know I, how do I communicate I don't know what they're thinking so there were all these different reasons that would hold me back but this week I cautiously intentionally chose to be different I went to an animal shelter with my friend. I called her and said, hey, can we go? And we went and at first I was timid. I was like, oh, what should I do? Let me just look at them, you know, <laughs> find the gentlest kitten, cat of all. Uh, and then slowly and surely I started petting. I, I first just on top of their head and between their ears. And then I went like this and they, oh, it was just so cute. It was so loving. It was so freeing to be that open to be that loving, to be that expressive and to expect nothing in return and to put my fears and my, my um, intimidations and things like that aside and to experience myself being that way was just amazing. I even held the kitten. I did. It was so cool. And I invite you to experience life in that way you know experience life in a different way by consciously choosing who you want to be the qualities you want to embody in your life and the two things that are going to help you to make that decision and to take action on that decision and to ask for support so it's easier to take action on that decision are uh, is courageous faith courage and faith together yes the courage is so you can take the decision and act on that decision it's not just a thought or someday idea but a real thing and your faith will help you to feel grounded in that decision and so it is easier for you to take that decision faith what do i mean by it faith in yourself Faith in your ability to experience what it is that you are wanting to experience. Uh, faith in that the good will come out of it. That you will learn, you will grow, you will enjoy. And so just have faith in it and, and really connect with that faith. With that, I leave you and I invite you uh, to share with me what who you are being and what your experience is by choosing uh, to be a different version of yourself in any given moment uh, the faith connector is my website social media the faith connector look forward to hearing from you bye